I know y'all hot. I know y'all hot. I know y'all mad. A part of me, a part of me really don't care. A part of me really don't care, but another part of me is like, wow, y'all really invested in this game. So am I though. I don't know why I acted like that the last episode. I watched it back when I edited it and I was like, yo, you're doing the most. But at the same time, I understand why I did everything I did. You gotta understand, I'm playing this game probably different than y'all are used to. How y'all gonna get mad at somebody for playing the game a different way than what you've already seen? That don't make no sense, but it's cool. Oh yeah, we gonna fast forward through this part. I'm, I'm gonna make sure Kenny still beat Arvo ass, don't worry. Kenny's still gonna beat Arvo ass. And a fucking chili, it's gonna help How is beating a kid to death gonna help anyone? This is your fault, and you damn well know it. Bonnie got the nerve to try and blame somebody for something when she's the whole reason I'm Carver, Carver found Fine. us in the first place. Good lord. Okay, well, they gonna make me feel every bit of guilt I feel yesterday over again. Let me take a look at you, kid. Get off me, Mike. Jesus. What are you talking about? He could have killed you. What the fuck is wrong with him? Mike! You're up. Mike, whose side are you on? Kenny's out back, trying to get some stupid truck started. His family must put a bullet in your head. Here, you should eat something. You okay? Thank you. Poor Arvo, man. I feel bad. I do feel bad now, but it's like... <laughs> the game must continue. I can't believe he's gone. Right? We got real people who have died that I've have been friends. I've lost people before, but... It just hasn't felt this... This shitty in a while. He was a great guy. God damn it. I shouldn't have come back. I knew this would happen. I knew it. <sighs> well, I'm glad you came back. Always does. We needed well, you. I'm glad you did. There you go. Accept the compliment. Don't get I'm weird. I'm gonna find something to clean that up. Thank you. Thank you. I can't take this shit anymore. Feeling better? Yeah. Hell of a day. But we gotta get moving. If you're feeling up to it, I could use a hand out back with this truck. He this house ain't worth a crap, but the vehicles ain't in bad shape. With a little luck, we can get one fixed up. Be out of here by nightfall. Really? Now? Look, Clem, I know we're all hurting. But I need your help here, okay? Everybody always need my 12-year-old help. You back. Can you buy us I'll watch him. He about to start asking Alvin Jr. for favors when he turned two. He's gonna be like, Alvin, I know you can't talk, but I need you to change the... <laughs> I don't know. Clem. Just be careful. I hear you, Jane, but every time I talk to Kenny, he be making sense. So we'll see how this goes. Arvo, if we could talk, if you could speak, if you could speak, you know, I'll try it again. But if we can't, if we're not supposed to talk, then she fuck it. What did she have to say? I know she was running her mouth. What did she say? I do want to hear why he hit him, so I'm gonna be like, you shouldn't. You shouldn't have done that to Arvo. I know, I know, Clem. But but Luke. I don't care. But you can't do that. Jesus, Clem, you know me. You know I'm not like that. You scared me. You scared all of us, Kenny. It won't happen again. 
That's a promise. See, we both, we both regret yesterday. <laughs> what happened? It's over. But AJ needs us now. We gotta stick together on this thing, all right? You giving the baby nicknames? He heard me last night, last Come time. Come on. Let's see if the truck's gonna go. That's how you know Kenny has no friends, because he had to come My inside. Daddy and... always had a half dozen wrecks he was fixing up. And find me. He was a mean son of a bitch. But he taught me respect. Yep. Girl like Jane could learn a thing or two about that. Mike, too. We're all just tired. Hell. I've been tired for two years. Damn. All right. Give it a turn. Okay, you got it. Who need it? Kenny, this shit busted, bro. Let me We're go so back in. close, Clem. I want that fire back. With a little bit of luck, I can get this thing running. And then we can get out on the road and really make some distance. That'd be great. Wellington's gotta be out there. Now those rumors can't all be bunk. Sounds good to me. We're gonna make it, Clem. I know it. Famous last words. All right, turn it again. Famous last words. Come on, Kenny. Did you turn it? Yes. God damn it! This man's bipolar with it. Kenny, are you okay? We gotta get moving if we're gonna keep AJ alive. We're running out of time. I if gotta this... get this thing to start. If this baby died, Kenny gonna kill himself. Gonna try warming up the battery. Go on inside. I don't like leaving him with that girl. That's a cold. Th that's a cold thumbnail right there. I'm, I'm gonna use that for the thumbnail. <laughs> Is that Bonnie? Hold up. Play with this. Turn that on or something. That did nothing. Busted. Telltale, don't have that as an option for me to waste my time like that. Bonnie, what's up? You was pressing Kenny earlier, but you but you sure got bodies on your head. Let's be honest, a lot of stuff is your fault. You and Kenny are closer than y'all think. Y'all brother and sister. Want one? No, I do not. Keep that funky ass cigarette from me. No thanks. Don't nobody smoke them. What a tree at. Do you remember when you saw me first? Back at the lodge? Yeah, I remember when Took I saw one you. One look at me and hell no, she ain't coming inside. What a great. I liked you from the start. You like that I called you on your bullshit? Weird. Oh my you gosh. You've ever done something you regret? Even if it's something you knew you had to do. Yeah, but you've done it twice. To us and to them, uh. Was that one wife name oh. that she smashed her face honest. in? I wish I never took anything from Arvo. I'll bet he does too. You know, I'll say one thing about Luke. No matter where you end up, there's always one bad seed rocking the boat. What is I don't man? think he would have ever been that guy. This man Supreme Dreams calling me. He ain't talking about shit though. Y'all mess with RDC World 1? Let's, let's see what he's talking about, y'all. Hey, look, when I call you... Here you go with this shit, bro. Come on, bro. Come when on, I bro. When I call you, believe me. Believe me. <laughs> when I call you. <laughs> what do you want, bro? What's up, bro? Good morning, I bro. I just called you. I just called you on this Sunday to tell you to have a good day. A blessed Sunday and get your life together. That man ridiculous. Alright, y'all. She's still smoking. Let me ask you something, Clem. When's the last time anyone did what you wanted? Well, you know, it's been a minute. Let me think which let me know let me see what, what I'm talking about. No one ever listens. I think people respect me. I don't really know what I want. Um I don't really know what I'll I be, want. I'll be flip flopping on my decisions. Maybe I ought to start thinking about it. Why are you looking at me like that? 
You don't know what you want either. You know, I've been all over. Run with a lot of people. A lot of men. Whore. And listen to a lot of promises. Ain't one of them come true. I'm starting to think there might be another way, you know? Lesbians? Huh? What you talking? I'm gonna go take a piss. What? Who say that? You gonna whip it out? What is Bonnie? That's not Bonnie, that's Bernard. That's Bernard right now. She said there's gotta be another way. I'm gonna go take a piss and walk straight toward the tree. Oh my gosh. What's up with the baby? Baby in here left alone. Hey. Mike and Arvo wouldn't shut up, so I moved him in here. God damn it! Seen that look before. Son of a bitch! Oh, damn it. I've seen it too. A few times. Then you know what's about to happen. What does that mean? I know Kenny's a nice guy, Clem. I bet Carver was a nice guy too. Once. Probably had a nice job and a nice pretty wife. Then all this happened. And one day he caved some kid's face in and realized he could sleep at night. <laughs> Kenny isn't Carver. He just made a mistake. All I'm saying is, start thinking about what happens if you're wrong. Really? You two have known each other a long time. Sooner or later, you're gonna have to decide how much that's worth. Wow. I think it needs food or something. It needs some love, Jane. Something you lack. Seems like you've done that before. You wanna try? No way. It's gonna puke. Clem, no. There you go. Hold it like this. Hey. Hi. <laughs> My name's Jane. I think it's gonna puke. It's not gonna puke. <laughs> it puked. Oh, bruh. It puked. Come on, Alvin. First impression is key. You just blew it. Aww. Right? Soften your face up. There's not much left. She was a monster. I was running with some people a long time ago down near I the was sea. In... Some guy got trapped. I was in Georgia. The crosswalk. Can't remember his name. He used to call me Mary Jane. He was a douchebag. Anyway. The dick got stuck under a car, hiding from a dozen walkers. One after another, they went down there trying to save him. Lost four people before we Damn. got him out. All that for one person? That's what I'm saying. I Didn't find out till later he was oh, already Oh, wow. Turned and ripped the neck right out of this old lady. The look on her face was... She was just staring up at the sky, like she was watching a bird. Look, Clem. Okay, Kenny. He got it working. Nobody trying to hear your shit, Jane. You just you ran off and left us, and you want me to start thinking weird about Kenny? Can you do that? It works. Okay, what Kenny. I tell you? So what's the plan? How much food do we have? At least a week. And for the baby? Let's just get out of the snow. I'm all for that. I agree. We should head back south. What? We're gonna freeze to death. I don't know whose stupid idea it was to march up here in the first place, but it was a bad one. She's right. What if we went back to house? Wait, what? Fuck that. I was thinking more like Texas. Texas? The <laughs> fuck? It was just an idea. We already talked about this. I'm sorry. We did? We're going to find Wellington. Yes! Right, absolutely. Wellington? Kenny. 
It's freezing up here. I'm with Kenny. We should head north. Goddamn right. Clem. My friend Krista. She told me about Wellington a long time ago, Jane. It's out there. Look, I don't give two shits about what you people think. I got this truck working, so I say where we go. And we're heading fucking north. It's the best chance we got of helping AJ. Y'all don't have to... What about our boat? Who? Oh, the Rusky? Yeah, he ain't coming with us. You're just gonna leave him here? I don't give a good goddamn where he goes. He's done. He could die. Let's, let, let's him ask him. Let's ask him. Us. We should ask him what he wants. There's a concept. He knows the area. He can help us. Oh, yeah, some help he's been. He got Luke killed. I ain't gonna say he helped the situation. But maybe if you eased up on him before, he wouldn't have run away in the first place. You ever think about that, Kenny? Either way, I'm not going anywhere in the middle of the night. Yeah, me neither. There could be a herd out there. You want that child's blood on your hands, Mike? We're all gonna die out here if you don't calm the fuck down, Kenny. Haven't we been through enough for one day? Jesus fucking Christ. Remember the last time we had a working car and sat around on our asses, Clem? I'm going inside. God damn it! You can't just walk away from us. Oh gosh. This is what this is where we start dividing. This is where we start dividing. Why would I go with them though? Even if Kenny isn't the right option. You better talk some sense into him. For his sake. I understand. I understand, Mike. I'm gonna talk to him. He know he did wrong. That don't mean he gotta come with us though. Kenny, we can drive away right now. God damn it! God damn it! Stupid fucking... Gotta... Get the fuck out of here! It's me! Clem! Sorry, just... Give me a second. You gotta relax, Kenny. What's, what's going on? Close the door. Can you believe this, Clem? I bring them a working truck, and they act like I just shit in their cereal. I knew Jane would have a stick up her ass, but I thought at least Mike would have more sense. They're scared of you, Kenny. Well, if their big plan is to wander around in the woods, they ought to be scared of more than me. Did you hear me? We're all scared. Look, we got maybe a day's worth of food for that kid left. That's it. Clem, think about Rebecca and Alvin. I mean, what if Lee hadn't gone tearing across half of Georgia mm. looking for mm. you? A lot of folks died mm. to make that happen. A lot of folks died to get us this far. I know. You're right. Someone's got to keep this group together. That kid's depending on us. <sighs> I wish Lee was here. Wow. Damn! What'd you think he'd say? I think he'd tell me to not trust anyone. And that we should stay away from cities. We can't just give up on this kid. I mean, what's the point of going on after that? That's what people like Lee knew. And what people like Jane won't ever understand. Look, I know Wellington might be bullshit. But where there's smoke, there's fire. Krista heard about it too, right? You know... When I first saw you back at that lodge, I thought I was dreaming. And when you sat with those people at dinner, well, I knew you were growing up. And yeah, I felt sad, but also pride. Pride I hadn't felt in a long time. But I need you now, Clem. There have to be folks doing better than us. Something has to be out here. We'll find it, Kenny. I knew I could count on you, Clem. Look, we'll figure everything out in the morning. Come on, let's get some you sleep. Can't... So we gotta be ready. You can't tell me Kenny hasn't always had my back, though. Jane was ready. Oh my gosh! What a a light fell, light falling. What's going on? Hold up. Oh my god. I ain't even got no pants on. 
what I was saying was, you can't tell me Kenny hasn't always had my back. Let's talk about the group that uh, that I, I have the option of being with. I got Jane, who abandoned me when when shit was starting to get was start was starting to get too real. We got Mike, who acts like he wants to be Arbo's dad, and then we got Bonnie, who set us up in the beginning. I'm not sticking around with these three buffoons. I'm going with Kenny. Simple like that. Um, what is that? I know they're not trying to steal Kenny boat. I mean, Kenny truck, what? That's Arvo. I'm not gonna pull the gun out on him. Who's there? Easy. Easy now. Step back. Clem. Shit. This is what I'm What are you this doing? This what I'm saying. You can't trust I got the rest. You of can't it. trust nobody, y'all! Oh my gosh. And you're gonna just and you're gonna thumbs down my shit. That's crazy. That's crazy. I'm Now keep it down, alright? Nobody else has to get involved. That's everything we have. Kenny, please wake up. Listen. We just gotta get away from that guy, Clem. Okay? Who? Kenny? Clem, damn it, just we don't have time for this. Just just be quiet, Clem, please. I'm not being quiet. Kenny! Kenny! Alright, Clem. Okay, good, good. They didn't want me to they want they didn't want me to make that noise. Walk up to you nice and slow, and you're gonna give me the gun, okay? Kenny! Jane! Help! They're robbing us! <laughs> no! Good! Good! Bonnie, you have to go! Don't you touch me! I'm... I'm so sorry! Oh! I didn't mean for this to happen! Look at all that fucking blood! What the fuck did you do? Kenny! Kenny, start catching bodies! Just start catching bodies, Kenny! You got me twisted if that's the end of the season. You have me so twisted if that's the end. Okay. Clementine! Oh, wow. Look at young Clem. Oh, man, the goat. To go. Yeah, ain't nigga really gonna let us Oh man, I'm getting chills, bruh. I'm getting chills, bruh. Where am I? It's just a bad dream, sweet pea. And you gonna hit her with the sweet pea. What was it about? Duck? He's bit. We don't know how this works yet. Maybe it's like a cold. His mom's a doctor. Maybe she can help him. He's going to die. I know it. You don't know that? I feel bad. Why? I called him a crybaby when I hid the bug in his pillow. Oh, that's okay, honey. He didn't mean it. Lee? That's crazy, bruh. I'm in shock. Why did Lily do that to Carly? Cause she a hater. I don't know. Cause she knew I was feeling her and so she hated on her. She it. was sad, Clem. That can make people angry sometimes. 
Oh yeah, she's talking about when Lily got her head busted in by Kenny. I mean, her her dad got that. Uh, because of her dad. Yeah, her dad got that got that salt lick smashed yeah. in his face by Kenny. But when I tried to save Sarita, I mean, when I try when I people don't always make sense. Kenny don't get mad at me, but he but he did something worse. Okay. Because bad things happen to everyone, and it's hard to keep being yourself after they do. Do you think we should have let Lily stay? Hell no. No. I don't think so. I don't know. It wasn't easy. She a loose cannon. I don't know if we did the right thing. We did. How can you tell? Well, it's not like math, Clem. Sometimes there just isn't the right answer. I hate math. <laughs> Me too, sweet pea. Part of growing up is doing what's best for the people you care about. Even if sometimes, that means hurting someone else. I don't want to hurt anyone. It's not that easy. So Telltale, y'all just gonna make us do this as if Clementine's not shot? I'm scared, Lee. Or is that a skybound what element? What can I tell you to make it better? That it'll be okay. It will. It's gonna get better, Clem. You'll make it better. Everything's gonna be all right. <laughs> He's looking at her like, stop that crying, girl. Oh my gosh. The relationship dynamics. Now let's try to get some sleep. An ex-con. A felon on the run Lee. with an orphan. Both trying to find love in a very, very dark place. They just want acceptance. They just want peace. Here we go. Here we go. Fuck Arvo. On the left! Slow down! Shut up! She's awake. Oh, let's go. Let's go. We left their stupid asses. And you good. Hey, you. Clem! Oh, thank God! Am I gonna be okay? You should be. How do you feel? It hurts. Couldn't find the bullet. Must have gone clean through. It'll burn a while, but you'll be fine. Those sons of bitches. I mean, I expected it from the Russian. But Mike? Exactly. I could tell they were working on something. I didn't think they'd go that far. Yeah, well, who would steal our food and shoot a kid? We never should have thrown Where's away Bonnie? trash like that in the first place. Is Bonnie okay? They took off on foot. Didn't get this puppy thanks to you. Now that Clem's awake, we should talk about where we're going. We're headed north. What, to find Wellington? You sure talk a lot of shit, but you got a better plan? We head south, back to House. Carver's oh. camp? The fuck kind of plan is that? I think Bonnie said there was more formula back there. And we actually know where it is. Wellington's out there. We have to keep looking, Jane. Clem, you can't be falling for this. She made up her mind, Jane. Clem, please, this is suicide. Why don't you let her think for herself for why don't you? Me? Look, even if there is some place up here, it could take us weeks to find it. We could get back to Howes in a day. Tell you what, we can oh try my around as soon as you pry this wheel from a cold, dead fingers. How's that sound? Whatever. I give up. She acts like that big ass herd was feet a... off the dash. Damn, can he relax? She's trying to rest. Play game, Clem. I spy with my little eye an asshole. Your turn. Grow up. Go to hell. I'll pull this fucking car over. Go ahead. You want to die out here? Better than waiting to die next to you. You're both being children. Me? I couldn't see the damn road. Bet you're having trouble seeing a lot of things these days. You shut your fucking mouth. I am done playing games with you, Jane. Fuck you. You don't know a damn thing about me. Oh, I know exactly what you are. Nothing. Nobody cares about you. Oh, and you gosh. don't care about nobody but yourself. That makes you 
nothing. What is it with you? It's your family, right? Don't. It is, isn't it? I'm warning you, you little shit. You're just another type A asshole trying to save a bunch of dead people. Watch the road. I am, goddammit. You listen to me. You mouth off about my family, and I will fucking end you. Jesus Christ, I'm so sick of this wounded warrior crap. Just pull over. I can't take this. What? Running away again? What a fucking shock. <laughs> In the end, still only care about yourself, right? And where were you when Sarita died, Kenny? Huh? Ooh, where were you? I was there. I couldn't. God damn you, I love that woman! Who could love you? Look at you. You can't raise this kid. It's scared to death of you. Jane, Kenny loved Sarita. Of course he did. He loves having anyone around that does what he says. That's why he loves this kid so much. It can't talk back yet. Fuck you. You know the thing about people like you, Kenny? She You're going just a in. Bomb waiting to go off. Everyone talks about you behind your back because they're afraid of you. That ain't Mike, true. Mike, Bonnie, Sarita. You fucking liar, that ain't true. Everyone around you knows that sooner or later, they're gonna end up dead. Sarita knew it, I know it, and so does Clementine. I told you not to talk about my family. Fuck you. You fucking piece of shit. Go to hell, you son of a bitch. Jesus. <laughs> How you hit a 360 you okay? spin like that? You're fine. How's AJ? He's fine. You sure? Yes. Clem, you all right? Yeah. Kenny, I'm. Wait, hold on. She Go around. Apologize. One of them might have diesel. We shouldn't stop here. We're running on fumes. Got no choice. When I holler, it's okay. Drive up closer. Anything happens, I'll try to meet you there. At the rest right. area in a mile. Kenny. Oh my gosh. If that's the last thing we say Fucking to Kenny. Asshole. God, I can't do this anymore. Then, I'm serious. Then leave. I tried, but I just can't. Stop making him mad. Everything makes him mad. How are you not seeing that? Well, all you're doing is just making it worse. You you're are. Just like him. Okay, I gotta be to get to Wellington, then Clem, I'm out of here. You could leave right now. Are you serious? What about AJ? Look, I, I know you're close to him, but Kenny would never let him go. This is our chance, Clem. Don't you ever want to know what it's like to live your own life? It's snowing. Why are they moving? They must not be cold enough yet. Fuck! Get us out of here! I don't know how to drive! See that pedal on the floor? Step on it! Don't just sit there! Okay, okay. Stop yelling. You should have a lot. There you go. Jesus! Oh! 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 Okay, I'm about to smash X on it. I'm about to. Ooh, Shit. there it is. Shit! There are more of them. Go. Okay. Clem. Okay. Clem, okay. hurry. I'm Get on out. it. Jane. Jane. Okay. Wait. That's exactly. What... Oh shit! Oh, smash X on it. Ah! Oh no, it's a, it's a R2. Oh, Clementine, I heard catch your bodies a little bit. Jane. That's exactly why I stuck with Kenny, because Jane does shit like that. Just runs. Doesn't care. And she got the baby. Really? Really? Okay, I was about to say. Please let me see Kenny before the season ends. Come on, Clementine. Come on. Maybe Jay or Clementine, y'all. Ooh. Ooh. That is a... That's a debate now. It's a debate now. I've seen it for myself. 
we really went through two months of this just for me to to to, to understand what y'all talking about. That's crazy. Y'all really put me on. I was really talking shit about. Okay. Come on. Don't give me back. Okay, you give me back controls. Okay. Yo, Kenny. Yo, Kenny, are you back here? That gotta be the dirtiest hat. I know it stink under there. She ain't took it off yet. It's been three different seasons. Even though this season two, summer then, then, then fall and winter, huh? Okay, so rest stop, we made it. Can he please be up in here? Can he, can he please be up in here? Get up on the door. Go in. Woodchuck rest area. Keep your gun up. Can Jane? can he oh let's get it? Kenny. You alright? Yeah. Where is he? Where's the kid? He's with her. You left him with her? Oh, here you go. Jane! Jane! Oh, here she come, here she come. Wait. Oh, thank Christ. He a Christian man. Jane, you okay? Where's the kid? Jane, where is he? Oh my God. He's... What are you saying? No. No! Not again. Not again. Clem, look at me. No matter what happens, just stay out of it. Okay? Just trust me, Clem. How could you let this happen? You have to trust me. You're gonna see what he really is. What's going on? This is gripping right now. Oh. Oh, you didn't you didn't brought the carver out this man. You didn't brought the carver out this man. Can he calm down? Kenny, calm down. Can he can he don't do anything stupid? Can he stay calm? Get out of my way. Kenny? Damn. How could you kill a fucking child? I didn't kill him. It was an Fuck accident, it. Kenny. I won't back down from you, Kenny. Shut up! Kenny, let her talk! I'm done talking, Clem. Clem, stay back. Why does why does feel like a boss fight? Don't you come near me, you son of a bitch. Kenny! Get the fuck off! Fuck you! Stop! Please! Jane! Oh my god! This is all your fucking fault! Piece of shit! Just go! I ain't going nowhere! Fucking psycho! Go! Run! Not happening. Please! Go! Uh, 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 oh! Fucking kill you! This is bad as him! Do not have me do this! God damn it! You already know I'ma shoot. You know who I'ma shoot, y'all. My bullet out here leaking out of all leaking and shit. I'll fucking kill you! I knew you Oh my Lordy Lord here! Die! Fuck you! 
You hear him? Go! I'm right behind you. She hit him in the car. She playing games. James playing games. Oh my god. AJ. over here trying to prove to me that Kenny's a monster by lying to Kenny and setting him He's off. Alive. AJ, let me see him. I thought, I thought we lost you, buddy. I won't let you out of my sights again. That's a promise. I thought that Jane might have killed him. I, I was thinking the same thing, Clem. That's why I was so fired up. She never wanted the baby around. She, she made that clear. Yeah, I, I guess, but I just... Why would she... She was nuts, Clem. A disturbed person that had her own agenda and was looking out for herself. Shh, it's all right, buddy. Hey, listen, I didn't want that to happen either. I thought she killed Alvy Clem, and at any point she could have stopped what was happening by saying exactly. it was fine. Exactly, y'all. I never, ever hurt you. You understand? I was protecting you. You believe me, right? Just imagine what she did to Alvy. Everything just went black. I. I believe you. Okay. Thanks. Come on, let's put some miles between us and this place. Oh my gosh, y'all! Is that it? There's gotta be one more clip before I start talking. Nine days later? Okay, let's see what they're talking. Please be Wellington. Please be looking at Wellington. Or there's smoke, there's fire. It's just a little further. We're almost there. I sure hope that's a cook fire. Oh, we could use a hot meal right about now. Might be all I need. Come on, I'll race you to the top. <laughs> hey! <laughs> Come on, Alvy, we got this. <laughs> Please. You cheated. Holy shit. We did it, Clem. That's gotta be it. I... 
<laughs> Looks like a big wall. What? Out here? In the middle of nowhere? No. That's gotta be it. What are we waiting for? Come on! This one's gonna be the one. Look at those walls. We'll finally feel safe, Clem. Be able to sleep at night. Oh! What? That's far enough. Just stay still, Clem. Do as she says. Put your hands up, Clem. Drop your weapons. Oh, wow. Approach the gate. Just a couple of people at the front gate. They don't look like trouble. Sounds good. Hi, Hi I'm Edith. Edith. Name's Kenny. And this year's Clementine. Hello. Oh, what a handsome boy. Look at him. What's his name? Alvin. Junior. Oh, he's gonna be a little heartbreaker when he grows up. Can you let us in? We're really hungry. Come what? on, Edith. Well, I'm afraid this is the part where I give you the bad news. The hell's this? That's some supplies. Food, water, what? some medicine, a first aid kit. Why are kit. you giving us this? Unfortunately, our community isn't accepting new members. We're over capacity as it is, and there's just not enough to go around if we keep bringing people in. Things might change you in a few months. You gotta be fucking kidding me. I'm sorry. I really am. But, but, we have a baby. This, this is hard for me, too. I don't want to turn anyone away, especially children. But... Just take the kids. What? Please, just take the kids. It's too dangerous out here for them. Kenny, it's I... It's just a little girl and a baby boy. You can make room for that. You can take back the supplies you gave us if that helps. Please, just... I need them to be safe. And it's safe in there. I know that. Just ask someone, please. They won't make it oh out here. Oh my gosh. Please. Well, I'll ask. Just give me a second. Oh... <sighs> My gosh. You don't need to look at me like that. This is for the best. We're not staying here without you. Yes, you are. No, we're not. Yes, you are. It's safe here. You two will be safe. That's what's important now. We can take the children, but just the children. I made the case that... Thank you. Thank you. Listen, okay? Listen. This is your chance for you and this boy. I don't trust myself to keep you two safe. Not anymore. Please, I'm begging you. Please, stay here. Stay here where it's safe. Where you two will have a chance. No, no, no! Why are you doing this? Because it's the only way for both of you. Think about Alvy here. Please, Clem, just do as I'm asking. This one last time. Oh my gosh. You'll meet people. You'll make friends. People better than me. Good people. Okay. Okay, we'll stay. Good. We'll stay. This is the right decision. Okay? Right. When he's grown, you tell him about his mommy and his daddy and all the people who tried to keep him safe. You tell him, okay? He deserves to know. If I was playing this at nighttime, uh, I got to. I'll be right there with him. Oh, here. Here. Take this. Damn, he said you get a new hat. When he. When he's old oh. enough, you make him wear it. He'll. It'll keep the sun out of his eyes. That's important. Wow. All right. Good. 
keep an eye out for him. Please. Wow. Now, you take care of Alvin here. You, you live a good life, okay? Wow. Don't waste this, okay? Now, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go before one of us, before one of us changes their mind. Now, I'm gonna walk away. I might not look back. Not because I don't want to. I'm real glad to have met you. Oh, man. Golly, bro. I gotta see how other people play these finales. Kenny. Golly, bro. percent of players are with AJ at Wellington. What? I could have left with Kenny and what? No, oh, Kenny sat up there and told me. Huh? Kenny sat up there and told me that I had to go to Wellington. How is it that I'm only 21% of players Okay, look, how about this? I'm gonna let it, I'm gonna let it rock and I'm gonna upload the video and if y'all are in the comments telling me I could have left it with Kenny, I'm gonna leave with Kenny. I'm over here doing what Kenny told me to do, but I'm gonna leave with Kenny if it's like a whole new game. But if we all end up in Wellington like if I still end up in Wellington with just me and AJ, I'm gonna just leave it how it is. But let's just talk about how it was how I was right for a second. So obviously this man Arvo and Mike and Bonnie were on some bullshit. And they were the main ones talking about, Kenny, calm down, calm down. And at times, I was even like, Kenny, you doing too much? But I also was not messing with Arvo. And y'all can be like, well, Berlisa, you did, you did rob Arvo of his only supplies. Arvo came up there with a desert eagle and he was speaking a different language. And like I said before, we had people who needed it. He sounded like a liar talking about my sick sister. No, we. and then I was like, wait, it's just you and your sister? And he was like, no, I got other people. And it's like, bro, then, then say that when I first asked you about it. No, I gotta rob you, because you a dirtball. And then for Mike to sit up here and try and like baby him the entire time, so much so that they willing to rob Kenny, Kenny, who, oh my gosh, Kenny who invited them in to that big cabin. Bonnie was the one who brought Carver to that big cabin, set it all off, had people dying. Then they all bring in them walkers. Bonnie, that's still your fault. Had that gunshot not happened, the walkers wouldn't have been there, and then Sarita still would have been alive. Alvin would have been alive. Uh, that other guy, the, the ball guy, he would have been alive. And it's just like, damn, like y'all really are. You really don't mess with Kenny, but Kenny's the only one trying to keep things moving. This girl Jane was talking about going back to Howes. Where is that? Do we even stop anywhere named Howes? What are you talking about? What is Howes? All I know is that Texas and everything that we just left was infested with zombies. We had to escape, and you want to go back for some formula. Jane wanted to go back for baby formula. Jane didn't even want the baby. Jane had the baby in the car just to go into the house and say, Kenny, Clementine, trust me on this. And then takes out her, her freaking knife and starts swinging it around. 
Why did you hide the baby like that? You was going to leave that baby in that truck. That wasn't even our truck. That was some random ass truck on the road. Y'all can flame me for my decisions all day long, but just know at the end of the day, it was me and Kenny. It was just it, like how it was when I first met Kenny. The same thing. It was me and Kenny. When I seen Kenny in that cabin, I told myself, it's just going to be me and Kenny. And it paid off. This dude really brought me and a baby to Wellington, sacrificed himself, and is walking right back to house. He's going to house. Kenny is soldier, bro. It goes Lee, Kenny, Luke. Everybody else can kiss. Oh, maybe Charlie too, or Chuck. Chuck, Chuck was cool. All right, y'all. Well, with that being said, there's Walking Dead season two. Um, I don't know why I didn't think to do this, but I gotta order Walking Dead season three now. Maybe I can find it in a GameStop or something. But until I find that, um, we'll play something else in the meantime. Maybe this week I'll play The Evil Within. The Evil Within. Uh, I know Walking Dead can be kind of tiring on people who have seen it from beginning to end, but this is all, this is lit to me. Like, Walking Dead, like, this whole game is, is tight, so. But I will get on The Evil Within, because uh, they're, they're making a part two, and I do want to get on that when it comes out, so. Um, yeah. That being said, uh, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Truly appreciate it. Um, if you are new, please subscribe for daily videos close to daily videos oh, that's what i'm gonna start saying if you are new please subscribe for close to daily videos <laughs> and as always i love each and every one of you and i'll see you in the next video i sent heisers peace wow rest in peace kenny you a real one too bro season one when i was lee we had problems season two as clementine legendary shit bro